I can't say it. Hrithik. I can't say it. Just say Hrithik. It hurts my brain. <laughs> John Abraham, he's 43. He is an Indian actor, producer, and a former model who appears in Hindi films. He also has his own production company called John Abraham Entertainment. Mm -hmm. And because of his athletic and muscular physique, he's been named one of the most influential sex symbols in Bollywood. He must only be able to play like like handsome villains, like Bond villains, because it's just like he's he's blown past like the, the dude that you think you can get. So Hrithik Roshan, he's 42 years old and he's an Indian film actor. He grew up as a child actor and made his debut in a leading role in one of his father's movies. But he has established a successful career in Bollywood and he's won six Filmfare Awards. Apart from acting, he's a stage performer though and he's also hosted the reality show Just Dance. Not being crazy after being a child, child actor. Child star? Is, yeah, he's like, that's hard to do. So for round one, we're going to be looking at Instagram accounts and we're going to start with John Abraham. Alright, cool. Let's right. get to this. I want to see this guy. Cool. Yeah, he's a stud. He's into That's it. A, oh! Yeah. Look at him. Yeah. Look, look at, at him. That. Shut up. He's a pilot and he's like that strong. Captain John and his soldiers. I mean, look at this guy. This guy's a physical specimen. He looks like scary, but I'm into it. Are they, are they literally saying like they're making Rocky, but... A handsome they, version? They, yeah. They made a movie called Rocky Handsome. <laughs> And he's the star in Rocky Handsome. Why would they call it Rocky Handsome? Is that really the name of a movie? It looks like it's something Sylvester Stallone there a little bit. She's jealous. Look at that! He looks like dirty. I like that. I don't. <laughs> Do you have veins like that, bro? Do you even lift? Forearms or where it's at. And like, I only get those kind of veins if you like don't eat for a day or don't drink anything. I like him. He's he cool, but he's cool. I'm yeah. more proud of this, and he's probably oh, got a tremendous, him. not the hair, but the muscle. He's probably got a oh, he's tremendous, be, like, that like that, like, yeah. if he goes like that, forget it. So next we're going to look at Hendrick's uh, Instagram feed. Sweet. This guy's a stud. I said that about the other guy. He is man on a mission to live the best life possible. Um, he's a really interesting looking guy. He's yeah. got really sharp. Seriously, crazy features. Good way to live. I'm already less intimidated than I am with yeah. the other dude. Yeah, that's cool. I was watching that. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta like pick up the pace. I'm sorry. <laughs> like that's like staring to your soul type eyes. It looks like he's like invested in projects that he really and like clearly on. likes who he works with, yeah. like promoting the other people in the movie. He's posting pictures of the other actors too. It's not just what a homie. He's got a family. Families always help. His son, Archery. Legendary Boom. warriors in the making, or so they hope. <laughs> Posting fan art. Yeah. You get a lot of credit Kudos. in my book there. Kudos to that. So I'm gonna unfollow. Oh, no, wait, I just don't unfollow. <laughs> no worries. I don't like him. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We'll say that. Yeah. I'll like. I'll like. Uh, I like it. It's less self indulgent. For round cool. one. John. John Abram. John Abram. Abraham. Peter. John Abram. Officially. Officially, officially, officially I choose John, John Abraham. Abraham. His Instagram, despite the veins. Can't really beat that. So for round two, we're going to be comparing magazine covers Ooh. on how to See, look cool in the heat. That's what his. That's what his story is. I don't think that jacket fits him that well, though. But you know what though? I wasn't feeling him. I like this outfit he's got. Yeah. You know, but look at the tie and the jeans. Modern Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg gets his very high, does he? Oh, it's a great look. I'm just saying, like, and the way I blame his tailor hair brings it all together. I don't blame him. I would never blame him. That thing like stretches all the way across his chest. Though. What if it's it like, pops? Like it looks like it's just gonna pop. Then he'd probably die. You like vein? You, you yeah. like forearm veins? Who likes vascularity? Oh, Jesus here. Christ, that's a highway. Or at least he wouldn't be able to do the the shrugs anymore. The shrugs, yeah. yeah. You like, like this that, one? Yeah. You want to just shirt off? Yeah. It's a body that doesn't quit. No, that it's <laughs> there's no there's no punching out the clock on that. Oh, oh Priyanka Chopra's in this one. Oh, okay. I know that person. Priyanka Chopra? No. No. He doesn't really do a lot of fashion stuff. He just does a lot of shirtless. Yeah. Last belly fat fist. <laughs> That's on like every cover of Men's Health, like every day. We're speechless. Kind of. Yeah. Fifty coolest gadgets on the planet. He's 
probably one of the 50 coolest gadgets. What the hell is chess boxing? <laughs> what is chess boxing? I mean, that's 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 a face. Yes, the face. Those eyes, man. The ultimate guide to rocking a mustache. These are hilarious. He's got like almost my hair now. Not quite because it is better, but I like the curly look. Yeah, uh uh, don't you say that. Don't I mean, you he, say he just has short. more money. I mean, that's the only way I know how. Separation is worth his death. What's wrong with this guy? He breaks his silence on his divorce. This is like going classic, like bodybuilder. Like these guys are bodybuilder flexing right here. No one has like that curve in real life. Maybe he does. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know his life. That like your back comes in that big and then that it's just. Well, see, he's, he's, he's doing. He's, he's, he's doing the. It's a. It's a bodybuilder. That's no, what cheating. they do. Keith Rick Rochon, how you can get this body and keep it forever. Never mind. I mean, look at his oh, the hair. Hair. That's not cheap. <laughs> John Abraham. I'm sticking with um uh Heathrick. I think overall John Abraham yeah. won. If only for the GQ cover. But I really like this one. Yeah. <laughs> so so that's I that want one. him to win. I'm going with Heathrick. Yeah. yeah. Where Sean like is actually actually losing like life. No, these are two He's amazing doing... looking guys. Yeah. So for round three, we're gonna be watching movie trailers. The first one we're gonna be watching is John Abraham's movie, Rocky Handsome. Oh, great. I'm very excited to see it. It's <laughs> <Just like, laughs> about a man who sets out to take vengeance against a drug mafia after they take away an eight-year-old girl that he has a special bond with. You guys can go ahead and hit play whenever you're ready. Great. So it's different from Rocky. How do you get that out? He's that potty. Yeah. These guys jacked. They fucked with the wrong man here. Yeah. What? Jeez. What? Oh, shit. Whoa. This guy just sliced him like 30 times in two in like three seconds. He just stabbed him like 40 times. Yep. I wish I didn't talk so much. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of concerned he's gonna kick my ass. I don't like him giving the name Rocky though, man. Rocky Balboa. You just broke the stick on me, bro. This guy's insane. I like this a lot. He took his little girl. This is Commando. Oh boy. She gave him the nickname. Yep. Alright. <laughs> it's time for business. Oh, he produced it. So that's the only clip we get of this girl? Is that it? Well, that's gonna make a billion dollars. I thought that was cool, but I don't like it when the leading lady is eight years old. I, I dug that because it didn't give away the entire movie. I would go see that. Yeah. I don't know. I'd watch it just to see what happens. Yeah, that was awesome. Great. Like, the action looks really good. So next we're going to be watching the trailer for Mohenjo Daro, it's Heath Rick's film. It um, takes place in 2016 BC and it's about a farmer in the Indus Valley who goes over to another town to save a beautiful young woman. We saw a trend. He was posting pictures from this. I think I read the book. So you guys can play whenever you're ready. Is there a book? <laughs> don't know. I do. AD. Oh, oh no. No. nice. Yeah. Twist. What a great shot. Like I want to go to... Those eyes. His hair and his eyes are like blowing me away. Yeah. Oh, that was a really yeah. horse whisper. Uh, oh, there she is. She is. <laughs> oh, I fell in love. Now it's it's over. They're both so pretty. I think they're gonna go to prom together. Sounds almost like the Mortal Kombat. Yeah. Only you. That that's it. You're the only one. This is destiny. I'm kind of like into it. Whoa! <laughs> like. How is this a, a good way? Buddha. What is that? What? Crocodile. Oh my god, wow. this movie looks amazing. It no alligator does, does that. They don't jump out of the water like that. Are you not entertained? Yeah, seriously. So he's like saying, I'm the hero the city deserves. What? what? Alright. I like the other. I think you better. I would sneak into, I would watch Rocky Handsome and then sneak into that one. The production value seemed a little bit less on this, the neighborhood. On this one? A little bit, yeah. yeah. This this looks like a freaking movie. Right, there's crocodiles, there's floods, there's like, uh... Love! <laughs> nah, it's cool, I'd watch both of them, man. Rocky Handsome sounds like a cool movie, but they, they're banking too hard on John Abraham. Yeah. Officially vote for round three, who would you choose as your winner? 
Abraham. Abraham. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with Abraham. Rithic, Rithic. I'm going with Abraham. I think Rithic takes that one. Yeah, for sure. Way to go. John, John Abraham, Abraham, baby. For the win. For the win. John Abraham. You did it. That dude's body rocks. John Abraham. For the win. Boom. Your veins look like a, a map of Kentucky and all the highways. We want to be you. We want to be recognized. I want to be you.